Welcome to another Spread Cheaters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spread Cheaters website. In this video, we will see how to find matching cells in Excel. Finding matching cells or duplicates is an operation you will frequently need to perform when working with datasets. This happens especially when you are combining data from multiple sources and would like to eliminate duplicates or you would like to find the matching cells or the matching rows within the two datasets. There are two ways of doing this in Excel. One is to use the VLOOKUP function, and the second is to use conditional formatting. So let's look at the first option, which is using the VLOOKUP function. We will straight away start typing the formula, uh, VLOOKUP. Now the first argument this takes is the value I'm searching for, which in this case is the first uh, cell in the names column for 2010. I'm going to look at the names that are matching in both the names in 2010 and names in 2015. So I've selected the lookup value. Now I have to define the range uh, where I want to look for this value. So in this case, it is column B. So I will select this column. Once the column has been selected, I need to specify which uh, column I need to look for. In this case, there's only one column, so I will say one. And the last argument I'll enter is false because I want exact matches. And now press enter. Now I can see that the first match it is found for the names in 2010. It has found a match in the column uh, names in 2015. Now, before copying this down, there are two things I would like to do. First, I need to make the range constant. So I select the um, cell reference and press F4 and do the same for the end of the range. So this makes the formula constant so that I can copy it down. The second is to uh, enhance the formula so that it can handle errors. So I'm saying if error... If there's an error in this formula, I want it to return a blank cell so that I you know, indicate by double quotes and close brackets. If I don't add this error handling with uh, the formula does not find a match, it will give an n slash a error, which does not look uh, very neat in the column. Now press enter and I can now copy this down, control C and control V to the end. So now I can see all the names that match. For those names uh, for which it can't find a match, it just leaves a blank cell. You have to remember that it is using the names in the first column, that is column A, and looking for matches in column B. So this will not return um, any errors uh, because I have introduced error handling in the formula. Now the second way of uh, looking for matches is to use conditional formatting. So I will select both the cells and what I want to do now is highlight all the duplicate values. So for that, I'll go to conditional formatting, say highlight cells and say I want to highlight duplicate values. So in this box that appears, I can select the color I want. I'm going to say I want a yellow fill with dark yellow text and say OK. Now you can see that all the duplicates in these two lists are highlighted in uh, the font that I specified. So this is two ways in how you can find matching cells in Excel.